Liverpool to Portsmouth, yeah, that chorus got the crowd screaming. New spot on the lake today. I haven't done this place before. Um, cool looking spot. I don't know whether there's any history here or I don't, I've got no idea. I know someone's been here because I've found a sinker. But, overcast day, still warm, still in the 30s, but um, it's been quite pleasant with the overcastness. But anyway, I'm just going to follow the back around here and have a, have a look. I, don't, I honestly can't tell whether there's been any home sites or anything here, but we'll have a crack. Well, this is a little disappointing, guys. There's not much happening here. A bit of copper, not much else. I'll spend a little bit longer. And yeah, all I found is a piece of iron, a piece of copper, and a sinker. So I have a crack for a little while longer, but we might have to get one next spot. So I just got a crappy little signal here. I thought I'd better dig it. It's a sinker, since I'm not digging much. And then I just noticed over here on the ground, sitting on the surface. It's relatively fresh too, by the look of it. We'll take that. Look at that cracker. Five cents. Piece of lead. So it's a flattened sinker. I would see. And there was one of those. Out of someone's boat, I'd say it was on the surface. And that about does me at this joint. We're going to find somewhere else to have a dig. Alright, so fast forward a couple of hours, and drive in the country, and we're back to the spot of the ring. Had no luck at the other place, so we'll have a look around here again. Another five cents. Alrighty, there's 17 here. Oh, there it is. Look at that. 50 cents. Sweet, I'll take that. And a sunburnt surface fine, five cents. It's definitely far more productive over this side, even though it's territory I've pounded and pounded. There's always something. That's brass too, that's very cool. Okay. Sweet, I'll take that. Nope. <laughs> the sticker just fell off. Can found some really crunchy big money. I think it's a dollar. By the numbers, yeah, that's what's going to be. Sweet, always nice to find those. All right, little surface find. There you go, them bad boys. I wash up like new. Red claw or blue claw, I'm not sure, quite sure which. Look at the colours in his shell. There's a lot of these around here. I think as the water level goes, the holes are exposed and the birds get to them. He's got some beautiful colours. It's not real well. That's his head. Fair old size, eh? I'm going to dig this one on camera. This is a loud solid 22 somewhere here. down there somewhere. Alright, put the camera down there. Oh, there it is. Another lure. It's probably the nicest sound of the day, that one. A little halco by the look of it. Apologies for the hurricane guys, I don't know what that is, could be a little coin, a little silver coin maybe, I'm not sure. No it's not, it's some sort of a button or something. Junk. A lot of rifle casing. And two bucks this time. That's my fantastic son there, he just come down and tell me to hurry up. So, I'm still going to do a bit more. But I'm in the bottle cap zone at the moment, three of them in a row. All different sounds, one was a nice crispy 15, that was a crispy 9, so who knows. 
And another coin. 20 cents. Sweet. Another dollar. 20 cents. Dead pig. Me and Charles hasn't come after me yet, so still going. Another 20 cent piece just there. Nice solid nine. I think it's cactus. An old school loris. I think loris. I don't know. Yeah, loris. Digital watch. Interesting. Last hole for the day. A dollar. I think. No, I'm not. Oh, it's a half penny. You're joking. The date on that 1922 33 22 I don't know 22 I think wow that's cool that's in good nick one side anyway sweet I'll do a bit of a wrap up later alrighty guys so here's the wrap up so UVEX sunglasses I think they're just crap. Three little lures there. That's my lead pile. That's that bullet pacing. My watch is a Loris Milo watch. I should put that in my junk pile. That's a junk pile over there, guys. And then the coins. So you got three 20 cent pieces, four five cent pieces, a 50 cent piece, a two dollar coin, two one dollar coins, and that 1922 half penny. That was the unexpected find of the day. Very happy with that. It's a nice nick that side. The other side's a bit ordinary. But it looks alright to me. Thanks for watching guys. Um, before you go, if anyone's got any idea what that hubcap symbol is, I'd really appreciate it. No idea. I've, I've done some research. I can't find anything on it. Anyway, thanks again. Cheers.